So three books for you to learn candlestick properly. So let's talk about that right now. Coming up next. So I bought this in Malaysia for 121 ringgit. This book, very lightweight, all about candlestick charting. Okay. I like that it is like straight to the point, and then the font size is also very big. Then you have like charts, chart examples, and then you would have all the different candlesticks that you need to know. Actually, not all, but the important ones. Let me show you the content page real quick. So you have your reverse, reverse. You have your reversal pattern and also continuation patterns. And it also talks about confirmation indicators, like for example, momentum indicators. Then for example, volume. Then for example, support resistance. You can pause and read the content page. Okay. Then the second part. What is it about? Renko charts. Renko charts. Kagi charts. Total content is not like a lot is not super comprehensive it's just like touch and go touch and go touch and go but doesn't mean that it's not detailed enough for you to learn things it is good to build a foundation using this book to you know learn the basics of everything and oftentimes for each candlestick okay there's only one example okay so if you are looking for something more than this if you feel like this is not enough you want to have more examples then Follow all the get rich quick rules. So the second book you should read is this book called Candlestick Charting for Dummies. Okay, so I bought this in Kinokuniya as well for thirty seven dollars Singapore dollars, which is affordable for most people. And the good thing about Dummies book is that it is very easy, straightforward to read, and also smells good. The good thing about this book is that okay, each candlestick they provide like more than one example okay so for example bullish doji star then it gives you two charts instead of one okay bullish meeting line one chart two chart right so it is slightly more detailed so if you feel like okay this is not comprehensive enough you want to spend a little bit more just to get some more details, this is a good book to go, okay? You, then you don't have to buy this book, this first book. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of things, you know, cannot stick. It's just those few, you know? Hammer, bullish engulfing, piercing line, harami, you know, it's repetitive. Introduction about candlestick, okay? So you can see in the first portion, it talks about introduction of candlesticks. You can pause and read. He also talks about like useful websites, which is like very detailed. Okay, then it goes into your candlestick. Okay, so it classifies into single candlestick pattern, double candlestick pattern, instead of like reversal continuation. Okay. Okay, you can pause and read. Like I said, you know Amazon, they already provide the content page so you don't need to look at mine okay next page next page and then the next portion is confirmation indicators confirmation indicators and then you see there's quite a lot right like for the previous book, it only has two pages of content page. Next few chapters, it teaches you how to use those confirmation indicators with your candlestick patterns, okay? Pause and read. Then final chapter. It has a lot of examples, okay? A lot of examples. You see, how do you combine your indicators with your candlestick okay it this is something that i've taught you in the youtube channel as well so you know like i always tell you if you don't have any money to buy books you know 
you either buy second hand books, borrow from the library, or you just watch my YouTube videos, okay? And if you feel that this book is not comprehensive enough, you can get this book and it's heavier, a lot heavier. I don't know whether you can feel it or not, but it is very heavy, okay, quite heavy, okay? I'm not that weak. I bought this in Kinokuniya for like $79.95, okay, $80, okay, let's count it $80. The good thing about this book is that the charts are very clear, very clear. You can see that, right, very clear and then it's circled for you. Because the dummies book, the charts are kind of like blended into the grey background. You still can see it, it's still fine. But this one is like super clear. The one thing I like about this book is that it's super straightforward. It doesn't like ramble. Blah 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 blah. Let's talk about history of candlestick. Blah blah. And then it talks about, okay, let's talk about hammer pattern. How do you use it and all that. You know what I'm saying? Nothing more of that, but some people just want to be like, get to the point. Let's say for example, morning star, evening star. Okay. Look like this. Look like this. Description on how it looks like. How to recognize it, psychology behind the pattern, okay, it's like bam, bam. Then the next point is pattern flexibility, then pattern breakdown, and then it gives you examples, okay, examples. And the good thing about this book is that it gives you statistics. What's the average percentage wins, losers, how often it appears. Over here, over here, the tables here. Of course, candlesticks, you can apply it for stocks, futures, and then forex, crypto, commodities, you know what I'm saying? And let me show you the content page, okay, content page. It is very, like, summarized, it doesn't give any details, but when you get into it, it is a lot. Okay, okay, the good thing about this book is that there's a lot of Summaries, like cheat sheet, it's like a cheat sheet kind of thing. Right, it's like a cheat sheet kind of thing. Then, you can see over here. You can complement this book with a workbook. A good way for the author to make money, right? So this book is a complement to this so-called textbook, so this is like a textbook, then this is like your workbook, okay, it's like school, going back to school. So the workbook is something extra, okay, it's not like there's any new knowledge inside because everything is already inside the textbook. If you know how workbooks work, okay, they are just to test you, test you. I bought this from Amazon for $33! This thickness, you trust me, 33 It actually has some notes in front of the exercise, which I don't think is necessary. I don't think it's necessary because like most people who have the textbook would already have. No, most people, what am I talking about? Most people that bought this workbook would already have the textbook, right? You can see there's notes in front. Okay, there's notes in front. Like where is the, uh, the, the, the practice questions? Where is it? It is. Oh, where is it, man? Wow, there's quite a lot of notes. Okay, it's all the way at the back of those notes. Okay, it's like MCQ questions, multiple choice questions. What is the name of the continuation pattern in the chart below? You tell me. The candle you need to look for is this, this two. You tell me an answer below, okay? If you don't want to like spend extra money, this workbook might not be something you want to buy because I feel like for $33 with this thickness, you can buy better books. No offense to the author, but you can buy a thicker, better hardcover book for $33. So don't be extra like me, okay? Don't be extra like me. Like You gotta remember that candlestick trading is just like a one of the things that provide you a trade entry signal because to enter a trade you need to do 
a lot of analysis on top because candlestick trading is technical analysis which is below the analysis process is like a triangle you gotta look at big picture first the macro big picture the sentiment fundamentals okay then you gotta look at the technical analysis for entry for entry points you know what i'm saying you look at the fundamental sentiment for the overall direction of the markets then to find entry points where to put a stop loss tp target you gotta look at technical analysis you gotta combine these two together to give you a so-called good trade with good risk to reward ratio your fundamentals to be in line with technicals you want the chart to give you bullish candlestick signal you want your sentiment to give you bullish bias signals then it's a good trade to go in don't just rely on candlestick trading alone you're gonna get killed just like all the other retail traders who only focus on technical analysis don't believe me learn it the hard way learn it the hard way you'll find so many times why is it that the chart shows me bearish 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 but then the chart still go up doesn't make sense have you ever bothered to learn about fundamentals no right all right so with that enough talking so with that Talk to you in the next video. Bye.